exciting state of Chiapas in the southeast region of Mexico along the Guatemala border. Chiapas is the leading producer of coffee in Mexico. It's also home to the wonderful story of Finca Argovia, a family-run coffee plantation that produces world-class organic shea-grown coffee, but also a leader in community development, environmental conservation, tourism, and agroforestry. We're sitting exactly in the tropical belt where coffee is grown very, very easily. We had the opportunity to recognize the way our ancestors worked with the plants. So it was a very easy switch to move from the conventional to the organic, increasing the quality and then being the leaders of this operation. Ah, what a feeling, no? Yeah, this is cool. And, and also the noise of the coffee, no? Yeah. You let it flow. This is like a big bean bag chair. This is actually what you get into the roaster and which is going to then evolve into a bigger bean. It, it pops up a little bit, huh. gets in a larger size, and then finally you get the aroma and the taste. People from Guatemala come over to work with us. And the beautiful part of that story is that they've been coming over for generations. I had the opportunity to understand the value of working with our people, to respect the way they think, they understand the way they live in these areas, and not to impose my ideas. Pues la verdad, yo perdí muy sentimiento en el tiempo de Don Jorge. En ese tiempo yo trabajé mucho tiempo el poder de él. Nunca me dijo él que te vayas o yo me quería ir. Me dijo no, no te me vayas. Me sirves bastante acá. Que él me ponía a despulpar café y cosía que procesaba café y iba yo soy gente y pues la verdad me hallé aquí en Argovia porque mis patrones me, me apetecían bastante, me querían demasiado y me fui hallando aquí en la finca como que si aquí hubiera nacido. La verdad me dio mucho sentimiento en el tiempo de Don Jorge y el mismo con usted, señor Ejido Bruno, estoy también contento, pero ya mis años ya están ya avanzados ya para seguir trabajando ya. La verdad estoy contento aquí en Argovia. Is this, is this technically uh, shade-grown coffee? Yes, exactly. This okay. is certified shade-grown coffee, also organic mm -hmm. certified. And the nice thing about it is, is that when you have these differential in species, uh -huh. it resembles the, it's the primary forest huh. all the way. So right. you have a, a huge amount of uh, the mammals, you have a huge amount of birds coming over. So you're almost creating a whole new ecosystem, but you've got your cash crop, the coffee, on the bottom. That's right. No? And, and what we target there is always the high quality. The same as the exercise that my great grandfather did. Sure. So historically it's it's the same procedure. And if you're not doing high quality. See, then I get my ears pulled <laughs> during the night, you know, or my feet are going to get pulled. Right. No? Yeah. We also produce tropical flowers and foliages. We produce spices. We produce uh, the tropical woods, which are very nice. And of course, we're into the tourism operation. It's just showing the world that. This is a beautiful place, this is a place to enjoy. And it's getting people involved with all the surroundings we have, all the culture, it, it's, it's really very, very rich and we want people to have it and, and enjoy it. Tourism here in Argovia starts actually with uh, the coffee buyers. They came here and buy our coffee and decided to stay with us a couple of days and they told us, why don't you open a hotel? And then in 2003, we became a hotel formally with these three cabins around us. I think a lot of people don't realize that there's so much more to growing coffee than just the plant. The environment as you improve and make it more natural, almost like a getting back to basics. Um, and that's, that's the point, Rob. You just said the, the right word. The, the whole idea is getting back to the basics, not to, to compromise the operation by doing stuff we, you, you really don't need. Like chemicals, pesticides, or right. it's, it's very simple. You're getting people to enjoy the elements you were producing. Sure. And that's what coffee is all about. Yeah. What you wish is to sit down and take a clean cup of coffee, which yeah. is going to take you on that trip in which you will relax and you feel comfortable and you're able to talk with your friends. It's a passion to be a coffee grower. You have to also have it in your blood to be able to, to believe in, in the future of what you're doing. It's your heart, it's your feelings, and that makes you feel good. Viva Chiapas!
Enjoy. <laughs>